Hello, this is Dave Barkley with Electronics Incorporated. I'd like to show you a couple of things that you can adjust on your TSP3 gauge from Electronics Incorporated. First thing I'm going to do is turn the gauge on by pushing the zero on button. And you can see that we are in inch mode by the IN in the lower right corner. And if I push down on the dial indicator, we are down four decimal places in inch mode. To switch to metric, I'm going to push the inch metric button or inch millimeter button and you note that down here in the bottom right corner it now sh shows mm so we're in millimeter mode and if I push down we're showing three decimal places out in millimeters however if you take a closer look at this you can see that the resolution of that third decimal place is only at two four six eight and zero that's not acceptable per J443, so we need to make a resolution change on the gauge. So in order to make a resolution change, you need to go into program mode. To do this, we're going to push the inch millimeter button while pushing the M off button at the same time, and that brings up this M1 to start with, and this shows that we're in program mode. Now, this M1 is selecting the uh, zoom resolution of this uh, uh, scale across the top of the gauge. We want to leave that at X1. So we're going to go to the next mode by pushing the M off button again. You can see we're in M2. This should all be zeroed out. So if it's not zeroed, hit the zero on button to zero it. Then we're going to go to M12, then a M23, and then finally M1 and then a space and a 3. This is where we want to be to make a resolution change. Here it's showing us that we are three decimal places out and that our resolution is set at 0 .002. By toggle through the options with selecting the inch millimeter button, I can just hit it one time and now I'm down to 0 .001 resolution. I'll go ahead and toggle it again to show you other options. I'm down to 0 .005 resolution, two, and then even more coarse settings. But we want three decimal places at 0 .001. And once I'm there, I'm just going to hit the M off button again and put us back into operational mode. And when I push down on the indicator, you can see how we're getting those odd numbers in there again. And we're three decimal places. So now we're conforming to J443 requirements. Now sometimes people receive their gauge in this condition to where when it's operating in metric it's working just fine having the three decimal places with the proper resolution but then when you switch it over into English or into the inch mode pushing the inch millimeter button and I push down on the dial indicator you can see we're down five decimal places and our resolution is point zero 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 five well this can be troublesome for some people so I'm going to show you how to switch it back. And when you are in inch mode, you're going to do the same procedure. We're going to push both the, both the M off and inch millimeter button at the same time, bringing up on our program mode and toggling through the different options till we're at one, our M1 space three. And you can see our resolution and our decimal point is set way back to five decimal points and at point zero 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 five. So I'll just select until I get where I want to be. Which is here, four decimal places and at the resolution of point zero 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 one or ten thousandths of an inch. And when I'm done, push the M off button, go back into normal mode and when I push down on it, you can see there it is, four decimal places with the proper resolution. Now, if you do this and you go back to millimeter mode, you're going to notice that your resolution is switched back again to where it only shows it uh, at 2, 4, 6, 8, and 0 again. So depending on whether you're going to be measuring in inches or millimeters, you need to set the gauge up properly. Now take note, this is our newer version of the TSP3 with the, uh, the red buttons. If you have an older version with blue buttons, you will push the M off and 
inch button to put it into program mode, but then when you want to toggle through your selections, you're going to use the zero on button. Hopefully you found this uh, informative on how to program your TSP3 gauge.